It's Build a Big Podcast. David Hooper here. There's a conference in Nashville that is starting today, a podcasting conference. It is called PodX. You go to podx.com. Here's what it says on the about page. A new podcast experience. PodX brings together your favorite networks, podcasters, and podcasts from true crime and politics to pop culture and storytelling, all in one incredible weekend. Explore the world of podcast experience, panel discussions, and live shows. Learn from experts and expand your knowledge of the evolving art of podcasting all at PodX. And this is happening at the Nashville Music City Center, which is our convention center. It is very large. I will be there in a few weeks for a show called NAM. probably... I don't know, ten or 20,000 people at NAMM. I don't know how big PodX is. I've been watching this conference for a while. Strangely enough, my company is called Big Podcast, and it wasn't always called Big Podcast, only when I started to focus more on podcasting. I looked at different names for the company, and PodX was one of the names that I looked at because of like X, like expand, multiply your podcast, and I liked that it was a short name. I found this domain was aware of it. They came to Nashville. I might have been the first guy in Nashville to find out about this. And really, for the last, I don't know, eight months, hasn't been much of a local buzz on it. Don't know a whole lot about it. What I read you is more or less all I know about it, except it's by the same company that does a Harry Potter convention. It is by the same company that does a Game of Thrones convention. So they are in the conference business. I've got tickets. I will be going tomorrow, maybe the next day, depending on how good it is. I'm going to let you know what my friend who was there today said. He sent me a text, and I'm going to keep this anonymous. And I want to give a disclaimer here. I have run a lot of conferences. I used to have the second largest music marketing conference, music business conference in the country about 2,500 daytime attendees, 40,000 nighttime attendees. It was over five days, 20-something clubs. We showcased 400 acts every year. So I know about conferences, and I know the work that it takes to put people in chairs. I've done a lot of small events more recently, and I know that even with a small focused event, it can take a lot of work to put people in chairs. So I want to be respectful of this event. I want to thank them for being in Nashville. I'm glad that this is more or less right down the street from me, right in downtown Nashville. It makes it super easy for me to get to, hop in a lift. I'm there for probably $5. Anyway, I got this text, and I'm going to keep it anonymous, as I mentioned, because I don't want to, I don't know, it doesn't matter. This is a well-known podcasting guy. He has been in the business for about 15 years, since the beginning of podcasting. Before podcasting, he was working in the audio business, meaning spoken word recording. He's been online forever, probably 25, 30 years. That's how long this guy has been online. So he knows podcasting, and I trust him. So he sent me this text. He said, you come into PodX. And I said, I'll be there tomorrow. How is it? Somebody said they have 1,500 people, but still very little buzz, as I mentioned. Is it a different audience? Meaning that are there people not in the business of podcasting that are aware of this conference and it's like silos? We have no idea what they know. They have no idea what we know. So here is what he said. He said, well, it's very sparse now. Met with a couple of folks and that was worth coming, but probably won't come back. Too many live podcast recordings for me. Download app to see the schedule. In the five ways on how to make money from your podcast session by it says one, sell ads, duh. Two, sell merch, set up cafe press, duh. Waiting for the other three, very basic. Not sure if I'll come back. Lots of newbies, but that's me. P.S. If they get bigger and succeed, they really need us. <laughs> so it's good to feel needed. You know, I don't know what to expect. It's a local conference. I've got rules about local events. I've got rules that I've got about books. When a friend of mine does a book, I buy it. Doesn't matter. I want to support independent authors. If you're a local podcaster, I'm going to listen to you. I'm going to talk with you. If you've got a local event, I'm going to go to it and I'm going to support it because I believe that podcasting can grow and as I mentioned, I appreciate these guys coming to Nashville. If you're interested in PodX, it's at podx.com. There are still tickets available. If you're interested in connecting with me at PodX, I will be there tomorrow, which is Saturday, June 1st, 
Twitter me at David Hooper. Reach out to me via bigpodcast.com. Thank you so much for listening to Build a Big Podcast. If you want more marketing tips, tricks, strategies, you want to grow your podcast audience, this is the place for you. And you can go to bigpodcast.com slash subscribe to make sure that you never miss an episode. If you're in the United States, let me give you a phone number. This is a trick I've got. I'll be talking more about this soon because we're going to open this up to the public. Call this phone number. It's 938-888-8894. Here it is again. It's 938 888 888 Nine, four. It's something I've been working on for the last year. It allows people to subscribe to your podcast via phone. This is something that came from the music industry. We have modified it for podcasting, and we are looking for a select number of beta testers because we are getting ready to go live with that. Again, the number 938-888-8894. It's a recording called 24 Hours a Day. I'm going to text you right back with a one-click subscribe link. Experience how it works. Check it out. If it will help you, reach out to me. Bigpodcast.com is how to do that. Thank you. I will see you at Pod X, and I will see you on the next episode of Build the Big Podcast.